my dear students so we are going to look at a circuit called a converter which is capable of conversion from one core to the other core first we will look at the possible conversion converters then followed by binary to gray code converter so if you look at the possible code converters based on the codes that we are going to take up the possible conversions will be so what i am trying to do is i am taking four different codes and then possible set of conversions okay the four possible codes which we are aware of binary code vcd code access 3 code and gray code so if you look at the diagram the possibilities are gray to binary then binary to gray gray to xs3 xs3 to gray gray to bcd bcd to gray then binary to xs3 xs3 to binary likewise uh, you can find okay uh, all possible combinations which are of 12 okay because uh, from every one you can go to the other three so likewise there are four from every one we can go to the other three so that will make up to a total 12 possibilities as they are listed here binary to bcd bcd to binary binary to gray gray to binary binary to xs3 xs3 to binary gray to bcd bcd to gray gray to xs3 xs3 to gray bcd to xs3 xs3 to bcd likewise here uh, uh, these are the possible sets okay so out of this uh, uh, one can go through all possible conversion codes but uh, we will see to the extent possible as many as possible so as a first case of uh, conversion converters we are going to look at binary to gray code converter so as we have uh, seen in lecture 2 module 4 lecture 2 how to make the design right so we know the design design starts with truth table so design starts with a specification actually so if you look at the specification okay so what is there in the specification what is there in the specification is what exactly that exactly you are uh, using right what exactly you are trying to design the design is uh, specified by the name that's all nothing more than that no more description nothing more description so here if you see it is a binary to gray code converter that means it is in binary input is in binary output is in gray so binary code is written here gray code is written here so what is this is input output relation this input output relation is known as truth table as we know we are so all the inputs are what exactly we are doing all the inputs and the corresponding outputs are listed so here if at all you look at what exactly this is let's say if it is a k map okay let's say this is a b this is c d where a b is msb c d is lsb so how exactly it look like it looks like this total how many cells 16 cells right so 0 1 3 2 then 4 5 7 6 then 8 9 11 this is 11 then 10 then 12 13 15 14 right so how do you write how do you get the gray code it's like this 0 1 2 3 6, 7, 5, 4, 12, 13, 15, 14, then 10, 11, 9, 8. The sequence will be 0, 1, 3, 2, then 6, 7, 5, 4, then 12, 13, 15, 14, then 10, 11, 9, 8. Okay. How do you write the sequence number, serial number? Here it is starts with 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, dash, 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 dash up to 50. But whereas this, it will come in this fashion, where is gray code. Is it fine? So same thing, whatever is there here with respect to the input and output. I want to get an expression for output. If I directly write the expression, wherever 1 is there, it will become a complex expression. So to get a reduced expression, we will be using KMAP for x, for y, for z, as well as for t. 
So, this I am going to show you in the next slide how exactly we are converting this data information input output relation to get uh, an expression for output. What is expression here? X is an output which is function of A, B, C, and D. We will see what exactly this from KMAP. Now, look into this. What I we are writing expression for output. So, for every output there is a K map, for this x output there is a K map. So, whatever is the values of x here, whatever the values of x that we have, now that what we are trying to do is, we are trying to put them in a map. So, these two our values are mapped here. So, what exactly it is? All first eight zeros. So, first eight zeros here. Next next zeros next ones eight ones so one 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 you can see those values and you can check it out right so what is this cell value this is zero cell this is one cell one this is three this is two this is four this is five this is seven this is six okay this is eight this is nine this is eleven this is ten okay this is twelve this is thirteen this is fifteen this is fourteen why the way we have written a B 0 0 yes what about C D C D changing from 0 0 1 0 1 1 0 0 0 1 1 0 1 1 what are those values first for what are the values 0 0 0 0 so 0 0 0 0 right even if you want the serial numbers, you can write serial numbers. This is 0, this is 1, this is 2, this is 3, this is 4, this is 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. For which cases it is 1? It is 1 for, so I can also write an expression. This x is a function of ABCD. F is, I can say sigma m. x is nothing but sigma m. 8, 9, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Right? So, year 1, year 1, year 1. So, totally this 8 ones combined. So, what is common over here in this 2? A is common. So, what is expression? Expression for x is A. Done. Right? So, how to get the meaning of this is x and a is same, really it is same, right? You compare x with a, both are same. That is that's what exactly it says. Let us look at the other case. What is the other case that we are looking for is we need to look into y and z. A, B, C, D are inputs, y and z outputs. Take the values of y, enter into the map. So, this we are entering into the map. For 0, it is 0. For 1, it is 0. So, the cell, cell index values, right? This is 0, 1, 3, 2, okay? Then it is 4, 5, 7, 6, 8, 9, 11, 10, 12, 13, 15, 14. Similarly, this set of values, you put it into this map, right, this map. So, what exactly that I am going to get is, just yes, I will combine these two with these two and this four. I combine this four and I combine this four. What is this combining this four? It is A bar B. What is this is A B bar. So, put plus in between. What about this? This is B C bar, then B bar C. Combine this two, this two. Okay. So expression for Z I got it, expression for Y I got it. Similarly, I can go for expression for T. So what is T? Is this value? That value you need to enter into this. Input values, anyhow, it is there. This all A B C D values are giving 16 different cells, 16 different cells, these are 16 different cells, 
so these are mapped to inputs are mapped to kmap variables outputs are kept into the map so that we get an expression for the output in terms of input okay so this is one set this is another set by looking at this this is what exactly t can be written as is it not c bar d plus c d bar is it not c xr exclusive r and say xr d c xr d how do you represent that c xr d this is nothing but your t okay so this is how exactly we got an expressions for the gray code equivalent gray equivalent code a b c d in binary will give us the code in gray as x y z and t i got expression for x i got expression for y i got expression for z i got expression what are they x is a i got it what about y i got as a x r b what about z b x r c what about t c x r d so three exclusive or gates required in order to implement binary to gray code from binary if at all you want to go for a gray code how many for a four input case i need three exclusive or gates so i can rig up this circuit by using logism and i can verify that just i am showing you what exactly that i did it in the simulator in the next class i am going to show you how to do this in the logism simulator okay